Okay, for your last assignment, I want you to do macro photography, meaning really, really close up photography, okay? You're getting right in there, okay. Now you know it's macro because, I'm just gonna put my hand really close to it, on the camera, it makes, oops, it makes, let me get it right there, it makes a little flower symbol up there. Right now it says auto, oh, there, it turned over to flower. Okay, then you know your macro. You've gotta get that close to something. So I'm gonna go in here. I'm still gonna use the rule of thirds and I'm going to focus in on that closest eyeball there and then boom, baby. Look at that. It's perfectly in focus. I can zoom in on that. If It is so, you can see every little fiber of that Angry Bird. It's a great shot. Okay, so macro photography. Uh, still use the rule of thirds. I'm gonna, I got a Lego guy here, a little mini fig. Let me go down here and, and get him. Okay, there we go. Rule of thirds. Okay, there's the little, there's a point where you get too close and it's not going to work. Um, it will beep and it'll tell you if it, okay, I'm too close. No, come on. Wow, this is a minifig. Look at how close I got to a minifig. Look at that, it's, it's, it's like him and I were standing together out somewhere. Okay, so you're gonna give me two macro photos. You're gonna pick something in the room, something that's interesting, and make sure that you get so close that you get the little flower symbol on the, on the uh, camera here. And it's going to make sure you always follow the rule of thirds too though. Okay, so, so really, really do some great photos. Look at that guy, come on. And look at rule of thirds, makes it interesting. Okay, so two macro shots please, thank you.